Hello YouTube, um, welcome to Mo's Corner. This is my first video, so please bear with me. Um, I'll be posting videos once a week and I'll be talking about an array of things. Um, today we're gonna be talking about an emergency travel bag. Uh, most people don't think about keeping a bag packed um, ready to go for emergency. So basically I'm just gonna go over everything that I have. For those of you um, women, uh, when you notice when you purchase the Always panty liners, you get this little bag inside. So what I do is I use them to keep my liners in. And I put about 20 liners inside. Um, you can decide how many you wanna keep in there. And then I use the other bag for my tampons. I'll keep different sizes in there. And then I also added the Summer's Eve wipes to keep fresh. And again, you choose how many you want to keep in there. Um, also, as you can see, um, I have the three ounce bottles of body wash, um, conditioner, lotion, and hair moisturizer. Um, you want to keep, um, you know, some Benadryl. Um, itch cream and Lotrimin for you know foot fungus or whatever may happen um, and this is another type of itch cream and I also keep C bands in here uh, you never know when you may feel nauseous or um, you never know what may overcome you while you're you know, while you're traveling, if I can get it open. And you can find these at Walgreens. There are C-bands that you put on your wrists uh, to help prevent nausea. Um, also some Clorox wipes. If you have to stay in the hotel, you can clean the toilet. And then I also have this. I got this idea, I have to find the video that I watched a couple of weeks ago, but they gave me this idea to use a huge pill box uh, to keep extra stuff in. So in the first compartment is Advil, the second one, which is um, my allergy medicine, which is Zyrtec, then you have Benadryl, Pepto-Bismol, and then for this one I have Sudafed. I haven't completed it just yet. Um, so if you could um, recommend, what else can I put in Friday and Saturday for things that I did not think to pack to put in there? Um, the Advil, I just found one of the little clear plastic baggies to so put the Advil in. And Benadryl. Try to keep everything in tablets so it's nice and neat. And then this is a Sudafed. Um, and then also having a bar of soap. I know people don't use bar of soap anymore these days, but um, you never know. So also keeping on hand uh, a small bottle of um, Febreze um, deodorant. I have vitamin C and airborne. And everything fits into this bag. Oops. All of this that's on the table fits into this bag right here. This is your your carry-on, the um, I forget what you call this bag that comes with the suitcase set. Um, mm -hmm. Then I also have a Ziploc baggie full of um, pads. Again, you choose whatever amount you want to keep in there. And even though uh, my kids are out of diapers, I always keep wipes, always. Um, this little packet has an array of things in here. Um, if you want to clean your pores while you were out, or you want to do a facial. And there's another pack of vitamin C type stuff. And then for this one, yeah. 
So this one is where you're going to keep your toothbrushes and everything. As you can see, everyone has um, the toothbrush covers. Now these are just traveling toothbrushes. I always keep these toothbrushes in here. We have our toothpaste. We have flosses. Um, mouthwash. I always keep a razor in here. And sorry, and I'm better prepared. And that is my house phone going off. Okay, now, ladies, um, oh my goodness. I'm so sorry. Okay, getting back to what I was saying, ladies. Uh, you know how you have perfume and you want to take some with you, but you don't want to take the whole bottle. Um, if you go to any kind of um, um, a makeup counter or um, a perfume counter, um, you can ask for a sample of the perfume that you have. And so, not saying that, the, that they're going to come in this size per se. Um, this one is a roll on. But you'll usually find, if I can find it in here. Okay, so like this one, which is Red Door, you'll find a small sample um, size. Or one of those little spray uh, bottles. It looks like this, but it's super tiny. And it's just enough to give you a good scent that you need. Um... So, oh goodness. I'm so sorry guys. Okay, so um, basically um, you want to keep a little bit of everything in here and always keep it ready to go. That's the main thing. Because when an emergency happens or a mandatory evacuation happens, you'll have everything ready to go and you just keep it packed um, please forgive me like I said this is my first video um, so on this channel most corner um, I'll be talking about an array of things um, I th believe I already mentioned I'll be posting one video a week um, please give me a thumbs up like and subscribe and um, I am looking forward to your feedback. If there's anything else you guys can think of that I can add in these two empty containers, uh, please let me know. Uh, thank you. Have a good day.